The Renault-Nissan Alliance has sold more zero-emission vehicles than all other automakers combined. In July, the Alliance reached 100,000 units, making the automotive group the clear leader in sustainable mobility. This significant milestone comes two and a half years after the launch of the world's first mass-market electric vehicle, Nissan Leaf. Nissan Leaf is the best-selling electric vehicle in history. We are 100,000 people today on the planet driving every day zero-emission cars and happy and proud about it. I'm expecting this trend to strengthen and without any doubt, electric cars are here to stay and to represent an important segment of the market. Alison Howard, a grad student at Kennesaw State University in Atlanta, Georgia, became the 100,000th buyer with her recent purchase of a Nissan LEAF. The LEAF was really economical price-wise. It was something that I could afford as a college student. There's push-button start, which is really awesome. There's Bluetooth inside the vehicle, which is good. I can hook up my iPhone and listen to music on it. And the fact that it's all electric and I don't have to spend money on gas as a college student, that's great. Renault-Nissan sells zero-emission cars across three continents. In Europe, Renault has the biggest market share. Its latest electric vehicle, the subcompact Zoe, launched in spring and has already won over thousands of customers like David Strether in the UK. I do about 30 to 40 miles a day locally on, on average and I was looking for a vehicle that was economical. The range is perfectly adequate for what I need. It's quite a spacious car and obviously ferrying my children around as well as the work. It keeps it very economical because the charge cost is very, very low. It's a very usable and practical vehicle and after a day or so you forget that it's even electric. It's uh, very, very enjoyable. The Alliance works closely with regional and national governments and with public and private utility companies to build a robust network of public charging points. This infrastructure allows people to recharge their cars quickly at thousands of convenient locations, at stores, movie theatres and public parking lots. We need to have infrastructure to give reassurance to our customers and on our side we will also increase the autonomy of our battery. We have enough knowledge to understand what the customer wants in the future for the EV cars and we are thinking that there is a big potential because CO2 reduction will be mandatory for all the manufacturers. More and more customers are demanding clean alternatives to conventional cars while governments want to reduce reliance on oil imports. The switch to sustainable mobility has begun. With more than 100,000 zero-emission cars already on the road, the Renault-Nissan Alliance is leading the way.